Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Mr. Zaman and today I'm going to talk about Outcome of patients with a rare type of astrocytoma is worse than expected. Fine study. A team of researchers from the Nagoya University Graduate School of Medicine has reported that patients with a rare form of brain and spinal cord cancer, localized isocitrate dehydrogenase wild type or IDH wild type histologically diffuse astrocytoma have a poor prognosis similar to the most malignant types of brain and spinal cord tumors. Their findings point to the need for strong post-operative care for patients with this type of tumor. In 2016, to improve prognosis and patient management, the WHO classification of central nervous system tumors included a new classification of diffuse gliomas based on the presence or absence of specific mutations. Two rare types of diffuse astrocytomas are infiltrative and localized isocitrate dehydrogenase Y-type diffuse astrocytomas. Since they are so rare, there is a lack of information on whether the infiltrative or localized characteristics affect their prognosis and what this means for the patient. The Nagoya University research team led by Yuji Kibe and Kazuya Motomura of the Department of Neurosurgery analyzed localized IDH Y-type astrocytomas and found that all resulted in malignant recurrence and a poor clinical prognosis similar to that of glioblastomas. Glioblastomas are among the most malignant tumors with an average survival time of 8 months and less than 7% of patients survive for 5 years. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.